What's up guys, I'm Liam and I'm back with another video and today we're going to be seeing what's inside a 9 volt battery. Why are you- okay, there you go. Anyways, we're going to be seeing what's inside of a 9 volt battery. So, let's get right on to the video. Okay, so um, before I start this video, I just want to say I am really trying to reach 200 subscribers, so if you guys can do that, that would be awesome. Um, and also, I'm thinking of making this a series, um, like a What's Inside series, like what's inside of, uh, what, let's say, Motorola, what's inside of Motorola, or what's inside of freaking tape, or camcorder, or a tape recorder, or whatever, just, I kind of want to make this a, a series, so, if you agree with me, then make sure to hit that like button, and, yeah, that'll tell me that you guys want to see this crap as a series. So, anyways, let's get right on to the video, um, so, yeah, and I would not try this without the smarts, meaning, like, you need to know about batteries and whatnot, you, you, so, what I'm trying to say is, I would not try this if you're not cautious, okay? Um, but yeah, anyways, all you're going to need is a 9-volt battery. I would more than likely want you to have a dead one just in case something does go wrong. And it, Because I haven't had an inci incident where one of these have blown up, but you don't want to risk it. Um, anyways, you also want a mul multi-tool or something similar to that. So... First thing you're going to want to do when taking apart one of these things uh, this is like this has become a tor tutorial on how to take a apart a 9 volt battery. Um sorry. Anyways, I'll just go on with my day cuz yeah. Um anyways, I am going to get it from the bottom. So if you want to take one of these apart, all you got to do is uh this is going to be so hard to do with one hand, isn't it? I don't have a phone stand yet, which, like, really sucks. Um, hmm. Let's see. Hold on. Okay, so, um, I just kind of created a redneck, um, phone stand. Yeah, um, it's in the making. And it'll have to work until I get an actual one. But anyways, I'm gonna try not to put my hands on my bed. Um, and, yeah, hopefully it doesn't fall. Um, but, yeah, anyways... Um, what you're going to want to do if you're taking one of these apart is find the bottom where it splits off right here. And then grab your multi-tool. Uh, is that the right set? Okay, no. It's not. You might slip or whatever, but yeah. Anyways, you just want to kind of... Eh, it's really hard to do. Okay, there we go. Anyways, really, camera? Can you focus? Thank you. Um, anyways, you're just going to want to do that. And keep on doing it until you get this metal piece open. Um, so yeah, I'll catch up with you guys once I get it open. Mm, and I forgot something. Um, so... Um, as you can see right here, this part has a clip that goes under the other part. So, I would I would suggest going with the left one instead of the right one like I did, but yeah. Okay, so, as you can see, I just got it open, and look. We can see what it looks like. Whoa. Did that one just... Yeah, it did. Okay. Um, these are not connected in here. Okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. Uh, my cat just came into the room. Um, anyways, that's what's inside. This phone stand's not. This phone stand's working pretty good, I guess. I like it. I may use it. Um, yeah, as you can see in mine, they weren't even connected. Like, look, here's the bottom terminal, and here's the top, and they weren't, or, part of the top, okay? 
Um, anyways, they weren't even connected together, which is weird. Like, the batteries. Usually, because I've taken these apart before, and the batteries will be soldered. So that is weird that they're not. But, I mean, it's cool. These look like AAA batteries, but they're like quadruple-A batteries type Thing. I don't even I don't even know what I'm talking about, but that's what I'm gonna call them because they're tiny They're smaller than AAA but um, Yeah, you get six of them as you can see right here and They're pretty cool um, I've tried them out and um, in a um, Good God, I cannot speak um I've tried them out in other things that take triple A's, and they aren't quite as big as you think. So, yeah. But anyways, that is what's inside. You also get these terminals, which are... They connect the batteries together type thing to make one circuit. And then this... Eh, where is it? Okay, right here. Um, This is the actual terminal part, and um, yeah. Sorry about that, I had to close my door, um, because, first of all, copyright out there, there was a song playing, I don't know if it's copyright, but I'm going to assume it is, and, um, anyways, yeah, that's what's inside of 9-volt batteries. So, you could, you would either get this outcome, or with the newer ones, I believe with the, I believe with the newer ones, you get, um, single battery packs inside of them. Um, but I don't have one to show you. Um, but, yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys liked the video. I said guys twice, but, yeah. Anyways, hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you're new. And, um, yeah, let me know once again by hitting that like button if you want me to make this a series where I take stuff apart and see what's inside of them. Because I gotta few interesting things that I could take apart, but I need your help, so, yeah, and <laughs> I don't know what the pause was for, I was trying to think of something to say, because I don't do skit crap, but yeah, anyways, hope you liked the video, and I'll see you in the next one, peace out.